it's a beautiful day, a beautiful Saturday in Arkansas. Going down the road, going to head over to Rock City Harley Davidson. It's the monthly hog meeting. This is only second one we've had since COVID-1984 started. And uh, I have actually I haven't been to one I don't know in months myself I didn't go to the last one and uh, this might be well no I'm not gonna say that but anyways I'm gonna go uh, visit with some of the fellow hog members and uh, a little bit later we're gonna take a ride head up north on some back roads of Arkansas and go have lunch at the goalpost down the road for those of you who don't know what hog is hog is the official Harley Davidson owners group that's Harley owners group hog pretty a pretty good combination because a lot of people used to always call it the big old baggers hogs of course I think it goes the hog nickname goes back farther than that about something about uh, having a pig it was uh like the mascot of the Harley Davidson racing teams back in the old days, way before my time. Everything's been put on hold because Hog usually has a lot of rides planned, you know, some meet and greet dinners and doing charity work, helps sponsoring things at the local dealerships. And if you're a Harley rider, you know, it's a good thing to be a member of Hog. There's a lot of good benefits to it. Um, everything from, you know, earning patches, you know, for how many miles you ride. Uh, they have these, what they call, pin stops at the rallies. Because, but this year, looks like all the pin stops are not going to happen. Uh, I don't know. We need to look at the schedule because most rallies have been canceled so far this year. Oh, wait a minute. The pin stop in Sturgis will be going on for those who are able to go. But anyway, there's, you know, there's like roadside assistance. Usually if you're a member of a local hog chapter at your local dealership, you get a 10% discount on your purchases of motor clothes and parts and accessories. And, uh, you know, there's a lot of big benefits. I did mention roadside assistance, yeah. but anyways, we're heading down the interstate here. We'll be getting off here shortly uh, at Rock City Harley Davidson. And, we'll see, and hopefully we'll have a good meeting. It's always good to get around others that are into motorcycling. Even though myself, I'm sort of a solitary wanderer, but I need people too. So, you know, I need the fellowship and things of that sort of other motorcyclists because you got to be able to talk bikes, right? and uh, always show off the latest custom you've done to your bike and, and, and brag about your new purchases and whatever you know but with motorcycling uh, it, it's a great adventure you know? that great adventure don't happen without people right all right <laughs> actually i live about 10 miles from the local harley davidson dealership and uh just celebrated. Of course, they didn't have a celebration because of COVID-19. It would have been a doozy compared to the grand opening they had last year. But uh, they just, uh, you know, celebrated moving in one year ago. This last week, I think. I know I'm going to have to check on the date of that. But it, that was really a great celebration of a lot of things going on. They had like the Wall of Death. There, you know the boat, the motor drone where the guy, go, the guys go around and around and around inside the old board tracks. It's really exciting to see. And they had live bands and all kinds of, you know, bike show, car show, all kinds of great things. 
a lot of those types of things were missing this year because of the panic demic but anyways God, there I said it again I got to get rid of that word but um, oh there's quite a few people down there already and for the meeting you know they just built that new building and it is outstanding inside of the Rock City Harley Davidson dealership compared to the old building that uh, was around uh, actually Rock City was the third dealership at the old building you know back when I moved to Arkansas it was Jones Harley Davidson then uh, Steve Landers bought it out and Landers Harley Davidson he expanded it to more than one dealership and uh, then the people came in and purchased uh, Rock City and told suck Harley Davidson and and they decided they needed a new building, you know, a new, a better experience for the customer, and the riders, and the loyal customers. And it is a very beautiful building. And they got the, the water tower there to mimic the water tower uh, on the original factory and up at, up there in Milwaukee. Yeah, you can see that building right there. Anyways, I'm going to go in here and go to the meeting. I'm going to go to a meeting. Where's all the hog people? It should be down here. Yeah, yeah. getting in. Got to wear a mask at the meeting. And they got the Writers Academy going on. Yeah, take a minute and watch uh, some of these new riders out here learning how to ride motorcycles at the Riding Academy. I don't know how it is in your state, but here in the state of Arkansas, uh, if you take the Ar uh, Harley Davidson Riders Academy and you've already got your learner's permit for a motorcycle, after you complete the three day course at the Academy, uh, you got your endorsement, you got your motorcycle license, and, which is a really good thing. Uh, it costs about 300 bucks for a three-day course, and it's really, really great thing for people that need to get that old endorsement so they can get out on the highway and experience exper experience freedom of the road. Um, and, uh, you know, and I'll watch these people. Oh, yeah. Zoom on down the way. Anyways, uh, uh, we're going to skip the meeting. Meeting one, two, three. It's time to ride. Anyways, so we're going to go on a virtual ride here. And uh, after the ride, uh, um, uh, I've got a special announcement. So stay tuned for that. Uh, and enjoy the ride as we head to the Go Post to get something to eat. Uh, the hog group and the Go Post is up there between. Uh, Cabot in Jacksonville, Arkansas. We're going to be taking some flat roads and uh, it should be very enjoyable. We go into the wild blue yonder. Yeah, good group.
tires.
Oops, my battery died. Well, anyways, we made it to the Go Post. We had a great meal. I uh, had some uh, good fellowship with brothers and sisters of the Central Arkansas Hog. And uh, well, my big announcement has to be with uh, possible content. By doing this video, I got a call from the sales manager at Rock City Harley Davidson. And starting tomorrow, I'm going to be one of the new uh, motorcycle salesmen. Uh, there at the dealership and I'm hoping that it's going to open up me some opportunities in the future after I get settled in to do some test rides and reviews of uh, motorcycles that we get in new and used and whatever well anyways uh, stay 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 tuned in <laughs> this is the hippie biker Jesus freak and uh well, uh, the journey's just beginning, and we we'll shall see where the road goes. If you like my videos, please hit like, please subscribe, please share, and come back real soon because the journey continues.